In this video, we will show you how easy it is to set up infrastructure OS monitoring for your servers using the new predefined patrol agent and monitoring packages that are included with our latest TrueSight Operations Management version 10.5. You will need to have installed the main components of the TrueSight Operations Management systems, which includes the following components. Atrium SSO, single sign-on server, TrueSight Presentation Server version 10.5, and TrueSight Infrastructure Management Server and Integration Service Agent version 10.5. You will also need to download the Infrastructure Management Patrol Base Repository version 10.5 to your TrueSight Presentation Server file system. There are four simple steps to quickly get patrol based monitoring deployed with our version 10.5. First, Import the Infrastructure Management Patrol Base Repository and select the full repository with predefined packages and policies option. Second, complete the predefined package default configurations wizard. Third, download and extract the predefined packages to the servers you want to monitor. And finally, run the run silent install script on each of the hosts. Now, let's see how easy this is done. Okay, we're going to log into a TrueSight console on a freshly installed TrueSight operations management system. With an admin account, you'll need to have administrative rights to perform these functions. Select the menu, administration, and repository. Then click on installation components. Here we're going to import our repository, so click on import. And you'll notice that there are three options now, and we want to check the first one, full repository with predefined packages and policies. And we'll select our downloaded base repository file, and we'll run the import. Once you click on import, you're going to get the configuration wizard, and you'll need to complete the steps to provide the login information for the patrol agents uh, for both Windows and Linux. And in this case, we're going to leave the uh, login name blank uh, since we're going to use the system account. And once you complete those fields, click Next. You'll get the next screen, which is Integration Service Configuration. You'll need to provide the integration service variable of the TrueSight integration service agent that you want these agents to connect to. By default, it will uh, provide you with the default agent information that was completed during the install. We'll just keep the uh, default variable here. Okay, and once your import is complete, we'll close these out. And you'll notice that now we have our repository packages and our deployable packages. So out of the box, you now have three predefined packages, one for AIX, one for Linux, and one for Windows. We're going to select Windows, and we're going to download that to our local file system. Since we're installing our agent locally, you could take any one of these packages and deploy it out using BMC Blade Logic or other third-party distribution tools if you want to install it on multiple. Now we're going to run our agent install. Uh, first, we just expand this or extract this package to our local system. And once that's expanded, we'll go into that directory. And you should see the run silent install.exe executable. We'll run that. And it'll take a couple minutes for the agent installer to run. So as soon as that's done, then we'll go back into the console. Okay, now that our agent installer is completed, we can now go back into our TrueSight console and let's take a look at our configuration. If we go look at our managed devices, we'll see that we have our agent already in, installed and active. And we can click on the show history and we can see that the predefined policy for Windows has automatically been applied to our agent without having to do any KM deployment. We can see that our three predefined policies exist now. Uh, these are predefined monitoring policies for basic OS monitoring for AIX, Linux, and Windows. And let's go up to our monitoring devices. And we can see that our one server here has monitoring information already. And we have our basic OS monitoring, basic health at a glance. 
and we already have data streaming and event streaming uh, going on for our agent. Out of the box and very simple to get monitoring up and running with the new 10.5 TrueSight Operations Management predefined policies and packages. Thanks for watching this video.